In the heart of a bustling city, under the blanket of night, there lay an ancient observatory forgotten by time. It was here that Edwin, a reclusive astronomer, spent his nights gazing at the stars, seeking solace in their silent company. Edwin's life was a tapestry of celestial wonders, each star a thread woven into his existence. He had long believed the stars spoke a language of their own, a belief that earned him ridicule from his peers. Yet he remained undeterred, convinced of the secrets they held. One clear night as Edwin adjusted his telescope, he heard a faint whisper. Initially dismissing it as the wind, he soon realized the sound was emanating from the stars themselves. It was a soft, melodic whisper, like a distant song carried across the cosmos. The whisper grew clearer each night, guiding Edwin to a constellation he had never noticed before. It was a small cluster of stars, shimmering with an otherworldly light. The more he observed, the more he felt a profound connection with this celestial wonder. As the nights passed, the whispers formed words, and the words painted stories in Edwin's mind. Stories of ancient civilizations, cosmic events, and the very fabric of the universe. Edwin knew he had uncovered something extraordinary, a secret conversation between the stars and himself. As Edwin delved deeper into the starlit whispers, he began to document his findings in an old leather-bound journal. Each entry was a meticulous record of the stars' positions, the whispers he heard, and the stories they told. The observatory became a sanctuary, a bridge between Edwin and the cosmos. He felt an inexplicable bond with the stars, a connection transcending the confines of space and time. The observatory's walls, once mere stone, now seemed alive with celestial energy. Intrigued by the mysterious constellation, Edwin researched ancient astronomical texts. He discovered legends of a lost civilization that had revered these stars, believing them to be the voices of their ancestors. Each night, the constellation revealed more of its secrets. Edwin learned about cosmic events that shaped galaxies, about star births and deaths, and even glimpses of potential futures. The universe, it seemed, was sharing its deepest mysteries with him alone. One evening, as Edwin decoded more whispers, he uncovered a startling revelation. The constellation was not just a cluster of stars, but an ancient cosmic entity communicating across eons. This discovery was both exhilarating and daunting, as he realized he was on the cusp of unraveling a cosmic mystery. Night after night, Edwin's connection with the constellation grew stronger. He started experiencing vivid dreams where he journeyed through space, guided by the whispers of the stars. These dreams were more than mere figments of his imagination. They were celestial visions. In one such dream, Edwin found himself floating amidst the stars, their whispers enveloping him in a symphony of cosmic knowledge. The stars revealed to him the intricate dance of galaxies and the delicate balance of the universe. The constellation, now a familiar presence in his life, began to manifest in his waking hours. Edwin saw patterns of the stars in everyday objects, and their whispers became a constant guiding melody in his mind. These experiences transformed Edwin. He was no longer just an observer of the stars, but a part of their grand narrative. He started to understand his role in this cosmic play, a messenger chosen by the stars to unveil their ancient stories. One fateful night, the constellation imparted a crucial message. It spoke of an imminent celestial event, a cosmic alignment that hadn't occurred for millennia. Edwin realized he was destined to witness this event and share its significance with the world. Edwin's anticipation for the celestial event grew with each passing day. He prepared the observatory, equipping it with every necessary tool to observe and document this rare cosmic alignment. The observatory, once a place of solitude, became a beacon of cosmic connection. On the eve of the alignment, Edwin felt a mix of excitement and apprehension. He understood the significance of what he was about to witness. This event, he believed, would not only validate his lifelong dedication to the stars, but also offer a new understanding of the universe. As night fell, the stars began to align, forming a radiant pathway in the sky. Edwin watched in awe as the celestial bodies moved into position, creating a spectacle of light and shadow, a dance of the cosmos right before his eyes. At the peak of the alignment, the whispers crescendoed into a harmonious chorus revealing a vision of the universe interconnected through a web of starlight. Edwin saw the birth and death of stars, the formation of galaxies, 
and the endless cycle of cosmic evolution. Overwhelmed by the beauty and magnitude of the event, Edwin realized that this was more than a scientific phenomenon. It was a spiritual experience. He felt a profound sense of unity with the universe, a realization that we are all part of this grand cosmic tapestry. In the aftermath of the celestial event, Edwin found himself transformed. The observatory no longer felt like a mere structure. It was a sacred space where the universe had revealed its secrets. He was no longer just an astronomer. He was a custodian of cosmic wisdom. Compelled by a newfound purpose, Edwin began to share his experiences and the knowledge he had gained. He wrote papers, spoke at conferences, and even hosted viewings at the observatory. The world, once skeptical, now listened with rapt attention. His story of the star whispers and the cosmic alignment captivated audiences far and wide. People began to look up at the stars with a new sense of wonder, considering the possibilities of the universe's hidden messages. Yet in his heart, Edwin knew that the most profound lessons he learned were not about the stars, but about life itself. The universe had taught him about interconnectedness, the beauty of existence, and the importance of seeking knowledge beyond the observable. Edwin continued his nightly vigils, ever grateful for the whispers from the starlight. The stars, once distant and silent, now felt like old friends sharing their timeless stories. And Edwin, in his humble observatory, had become a bridge between the cosmos and humanity.